Telepointer, Sixth Sense, and Augmented Reality Technology, Class IST-110. Augmented reality devices project digital information onto three-dimensional objects, bridging cyberspace and real space so users can interact with information anywhere. A major goal of augmented reality is to create the sensation that virtual objects are present in the real world. The primary hardware components of an augmented reality system include display, tracking, input device, and computer. The history of augmented reality began with Professor Ivan Sutherland at Harvard University. Sutherland's 1968 project, a head-mounted three-dimensional display, is considered to be the precursor to all virtual reality and augmented reality technology. Head-mounted display, also known as HMD, is still an integral part of virtual reality today. There are many virtual reality and augmented reality systems in existence. Seen here is a 3D immersive cave used for scientific research at Cornell's Institute for Computational Biomedicine located in New York City. The difference between virtual reality and augmented reality is that virtual reality immerses the user into the digital world, while augmented reality strives to bring the digital world into the real world. Continual research is being done on augmented reality technology. MIT Media Lab is considered one of the pioneers in the field. Professor Steve Mann was one of the founders of Wearable Computers Group in the Media Lab located at MIT. Over the years, Mann created many devices that pertain to the field of computational photography and computational imaging. Among his many inventions is Aramac, a laser-based infinite depth of focus projector. The Aramac is capable of projecting onto any 3D surface without focus adjustment. This was a core component of Telepointer, a gestural interface system which man describes as a hands-free, completely self-contained, wearable visual, augmented reality without headwear and without any infrastructure reliance. Professor Mann developed Telepointer in 1998. It contained a webcam, a projector, within a dome-shaped wearable pendant and therefore did not require headwear or eyewear. The device was capable of recognizing instructional gestures inputted by the webcam and outputting information with the projector. His vision was to incorporate this apparatus into everyday living, such as purchasing items in a grocery store. Man originally called his invention Synthetic Synthesa of the Sixth Sense. Perhaps one of the most recognizable examples of an augmented reality in mainstream cinema is the gestural interface used by Tom Cruise's character in the movie Minority Report. The idea for this fictitious device was conceived by John Underkoffler, another graduate of the renowned MIT Media Lab. Underkoffler later founded Oblong Industries, which developed a workable system based on the same concept. It was called the G-Speak Spatial Operating Environment. Gestural Interface is an area of research which aims to develop HCI, Human Computer Interface, that can interpret human gestures as instructions. Gesture recognition is accomplished using computer vision in conjunction with image processing. An MIT graduate student named Pranav Minstry, also of the Media Lab at MIT, developed another wearable gestural interface device. The Sixth Sense device is comprised of a webcam, pocket projector, 
and mobile computer. It uses the laptop to run computer vision software, which interprets motions captured by the webcam. When projecting onto paper as a medium, he was able to enhance the tracking system by separating the microphones from webcams and attaching them to the paper. The microphone detects vibrations and senses when the instruction is being inputted. It also works in conjunction with the webcam to track the finger's motions. Earlier prototypes of Pranov's gesture interface were derived from the tracking components of computer mice. Through reverse engineering, he built a motion sensing device capable of following gestures controlled by an external system of springs, pulleys, and strings connected to a person's hands. The current system tracks fiduciary markers taped to the user's fingertips. This allows the user to employ simple hand gestures such as framing, resizing, and selecting to interact with information and then receive instant feedback via projected image. Although Mystery originally dubbed his invention the Sixth Sense device, it has since been renamed to WUW, Wear Your World. Real world applications for such a device include scanning barcodes off the shelf items to get their information. We'd be able to check prices for store products without human assistance. Obtain the contents of books merely by scanning them. Get up to the minute information from newspapers and periodicals. We'd even be able to check the status of our flight just by looking at the ticket. Although these devices are still in their development stage, augmented reality technology is slowly becoming a reality in our everyday life. Thank mm -hmm. you.